Amazon dropshipping in 2024. Is it dead? What are the perspectives, guys? Let's talk about it, guys, today. My name is Andre Kreisbergs, coming live to you. Well, wouldn't li I wouldn't say live. It's a recorded YouTube video, guys, from straight from Dubai, guys. We're chilling, relaxing on a little vacation, on a holiday, on a lifestyle trip. Let's put it this way, guys. How many of those I've done over the last years? I mean, I can't even count. And we're actually coming back to our favorite place again here in the, like, in very nice hotel vip hotel and um staying here guys just like to chill and make this video guys talk about amazon dropshipping because a lot of you guys are asking me like what's the best way to start on amazon and you're asking about the dropshipping so uh, i think i should raise this subject in 2024 right now if something changes i'll do another video guys during this year but i wanted to talk about it right now guys so you are understand you understand completely and you're clear on whether you should be moving forward with this model or not guys it's gonna be a very interesting video so make sure to watch it guys right till the end i'm gonna just turn down the volume of my tennis and uh, don't mind guys any loud noises and music if you i'm not sure guys it should be fine it should be sound fine we have a football team behind me guys luton town is staying over here right now brighton hove albion was staying literally like this week as well and there's few football teams are coming over next week as well guys so it's a pretty cool and loud place as well and we actually met the football players here as well and took a picture and put it on my instagram guys which is really cool and nice you know my passion about football if you follow me guys as well okay so uh, yeah that entire football team is right there behind me so um yeah guys anyway so uh, amazon drop shipping yeah okay let's talk about it guys first of all before i talk about amazon drop shipping the three ways that you can conduct this business model make sure to guys to um like this video make sure to subscribe to my youtube channel and make sure to comment where the guide below this video guys if you want to receive my free step-by-step -step private amazon fba tutorial 30 minutes private fba tutorial comment word guide okay if you opt for some um quick mentoring with a lot of a support from me personally join my fb mastery program the link is gonna be below guys or check out if the school of amazon is available that's my intense program guys it might be launching out at some point this year depending when you're watching this video as well guys okay so fb mastery program guys all the links below guys make sure to follow my instagram my telegram and etc guys let's crack on and talk about amazon dropshipping guys okay so amazon dropshipping guys as you know it's sim simply in its purest form like in its organic form is when you're basically taking products from supplies like walmart home depot in us or it could be like argus boots and all those any other retailers that you do in uk like zoo plus and you're basically copy pasting the title and the and the image into amazon or into any other e-com platform and you're basically just up marking the product you're making a sale and you're going you're going and taking the customer's details and you're going and fulfilling the order on their behalf from the supplier and the supplier ships the product to the customer and you just make money on the difference acting as a middleman that's basically how the drop shipping works okay that's the drop shipping concept guys in case you were not aware if if you're searching drop shipping on YouTube right now, you probably know how drop shipping works. So I probably have, don't have to explain to you guys how exactly this model is operating and what exactly it is. But I thought I might as well go and make a little explanation now as well. Okay. So as you guys know, drop shipping on Amazon, these guys are loud. I told you guys. You know, uh, they should be. They should be. Make, they, they should be loud because they're doing really well in this season. I think they should. They have a good chance of staying in Luton Town in the Premier League. Okay. So yeah. Um, the thing is, guys, with drop shipping, okay, it's against terms of services on Amazon. You're not allowed to, uh, um, you know, drop ship. Oh, my tennis player just won. Watching tennis here at the same time, guys, as I'm, as I'm making this YouTube video on here. And uh, Australian Open is live right now. And uh, my tennis player just in free sets. You know, going off topic, guys, I'm here. I'm, I'm sorry, guys. Just on the chill mode, I wanted to do those series of those kind of talking head videos where I'm like probably going to be at least five or six of them, guys, when I'm talking about different subjects. I don't really have much time talking about it, guys, in my spare time when I'm in, like at home and etc., guys. So I like to like making more guides and etc., more practical videos. And I here I'm actually talking about the subjects and etc., guys. So yeah, drop shipping is against terms of services on Amazon. Like, you're not allowed to drop ship from retailers. It's always been like this. It's always going to be like that. I've actually been drop shipping, guys, on Amazon from. Um, from 2000, my daughter's there as well. From 2013, 2014 till 2019 for like five years straight and didn't have any problems, guys. And I was drop shipping on the old account and etc., guys. I don't do that model anymore, guys. So that's the first way of doing it. You can still do it, guys, but you have a high risk of getting your account suspended. You can still drop ship the old fashioned way. You can still do Amazon drop shipping the way that all the people are doing it, but the margins are too slim doing it that way as well guys you got to remember guys the margins are very slim it's high risk and you can get your account to spend guys simply because amazon receives notifications from the customers that they are they basically receiving products in the walmart boxes and home depot boxes they're getting receipts and etc they're complaining and amazon doesn't want you to drop ship from those retailers because you're automatically causing competition for amazon because the customers are also getting a bad experience and they're also receiving products in the competitors boxes makes very um you know makes a lot of sense guys i'm sure you guys understand now okay now the second thing guys the second 
second way that you can do drop shipping on Amazon is through the actual official distributors, like like drop shipping distributors that are actually official and they're not they're sending in a plain boxes where your store names and etc. That's fine. But the usual problem with those doing it that way, you cannot really source many good products because the drop shipping concept, you know, entails actually selling products that are selling already on Amazon, you know, piggybacking on existing listings that are already selling on a platform, okay? That's what the model is all about, okay? So you're basically piggybacking. You don't really create new listings from scratch. If you're doing it the second way, you're prone to actually go and create the listings from scratch and actually find those good products. And it's difficult to find the products and the margin is also going to be pretty slim, guys, okay? But yeah, I mean, it's going to be better than doing it from retailers, but it's not going to be um, efficient in a way of actually running a business, guys, because you need to have, you need to have history of sales you need to have a proven sales record on the product that you're going to go and sell even though you're not going to pre-buy the products in a drop shipping model but it's still, it's still you still have to really just understand that you are doing it the right thing you do you're doing it the right way and you know that the product's going to be selling which you're actually listing and etc guys because dropshipping is a very easy way to make a lot of sales it's a very, very easy way to grow like the business model and etc and it's a very very cool model guys actually but you know it has it has its own risks and the risks factors and everything guys you have to go and make sure you eliminate them guys before you even start doing it right now that's probably why you're watching this video guys right now hopefully guys you're learning something make sure to like this video guys make sure to comment where the guide to receive my free step-by-step -step amazon fba tutorial to get started selling on amazon right away guys okay yeah so th that's the second Way, okay the third way the way i'm doing it guys the way i wanted to share this with you guys is doing it for the two-step drop shipping doing it the safe way what exactly guys are we doing we're doing it the very very simple and basic way we're basically going and buying products ahead of time from walmart from home depot from the suppliers mainly using walmart we're sending the products to our own warehouses in usa we repack them we you know we put our own label on our own shipping label on when we make a sale and we send it over to the customer that way we repack everything we hide the invoices and that's called a safe way it's actually not breaching any terms of services and your rules by amazon the margin is also a lot higher doing it that way it's called the two-step drop shipping way i actually offer automation program in this i actually made a video guys about this you know like talking about it like a couple like um, not a couple of years ago like a year ago you can check it out in the top right corner guys where i talked about the safe drop shipping method guys so we all know for this for the automation program guys we're actually making our clients a lot of money this way like 20 to 40 percent every month on the investments guys absolutely insane and that model is absolutely the best way to do it and if you want to be like drop shipping or having a model that is close enough to the drop shipping model guys because it's similar to fba but apart from sending the products into amazon we're keeping the products in our own warehouses and once we make a sale we're still doing the sale for the fbm way that way we're saving money on the fba fees yeah we have the shipping cost that we're paying to send the products over to the actual um customer that's gonna be like anywhere from like six to eight dollars we're probably gonna pay that in fba fees anyway we're actually making some really good money that way guys and that's why we can actually maintain very high margins and we have a lot of SKUs we actually can go and sell and list and that's what we offer for our uh, for a unique FBM automation program guys that you can go and check out through the link below this video guys okay so that is the best way to do it guys you can also do it yourself i don't really teach it guys but you know i've just explained to you guys the way you can actually go and do drop shipping model guys if you really wanted to do something like this where you're buying products from the retailers you have to go and buy the products send it over to the actual you know um warehouses like of your own or your own house and it will be considered as like fbm way fbm strategy there's still a risk to it like because you're buying from retailers you can get ip complaints and etc but if you're doing it the right way you don't really get in trouble just like you do with arbitrage when you're doing amazon fba model okay so two-step drop shipping all the way you can absolutely go and do it guys if you want us to do it for you we offer automation program where we basically run you hands off for hands off on this hand you know you don't have to do anything guys and i left you guys information about it guys below okay so amazon dropshipping is available you can do it for the first way remember your account is going to be under danger you can really you're risking a lot of the you're risking you're risking uh, your account getting suspended and etc the second way you know you you just you won't have much success and a third way is the best way guys if you can really figure out the logistics and everything or let us or allow us to do all the hard work and hard lifting for you guys we can do it all for you guys for the fbm automation program as well okay we can absolutely do it for you okay if you're interested okay just some guys walking around just to say hi it's very friendly people here guys i highly recommend this place guys in dubai been here like once here before like two years ago we came back here again good to stay um especially the kids of the family if you have like if your family man like myself i've got three kids 
and I'm about to go into the room right now to get some, some room service in it because my, my, my wife is hungry. I just told her, listen, I'm going to go and make a quick YouTube video, guys, to talk to you about the Amazon dropshipping and etc., guys, because I know I need to pump out some content, show, share with you guys what's happening, and I know you guys are looking for some on-point information, which I'm always trying to bring, guys. If you're looking for some entry, guys, like, like I've said once again, uh, for FBA Mastery Program, guys, soon to be renamed to amazon mastery like just a little disclaimer guys it will be called amazon mastery very soon i'm releasing a new program guys and you're all getting a free upgrade if you're going to be my student by then just keep this in mind okay and there's some peacocks walking around as well which is funny while i'm making as i'm making this video guys okay so yeah guys i'm gonna go for a little swim swim right now hopefully guys this video was useful amazon dropshipping is not dead it's actually the same as it was always but you know i wouldn't do it the old way i would do it the new way i wouldn't risk your account if you were to go and do something clean do fba do fba which is the model i highly recommend doing so amazon and FBA is the best way to do it. If you want to do something like to do with drop shipping, something to do with FBM way, FBM model, do like a two-step FBM model. That's the that's the one I highly recommend doing. You know, uh, if you compare it to anything else out there, okay. The two-step way, the FBM way, all the way, guys. All right, guys. Thank you, guys, once again. I appreciate you guys all as always. Make sure to subscribe, like this YouTube video, uh, like this YouTube video, guys, as always. And comment, guys. Let me know, guys, know where you're from, where you're watching. Always curious to know. All right, guys. Till the next video, guys. Check out my playlist as well. And I'll speak to you soon. Bye-bye.